What do you know about climate change? Climate change is a phenomena. I mean, a phenomena that happens around us, but actually I don't really know what it is. So, if you don't know, uh, what do you do to help yourself to know about climate change? I heard that climate change is related to something green, so I think I will just plant some trees or, you know, that kind of stuff. That's it. Okay, thank you, Nini. Hello, what do you know about the climate change? Honestly, I don't really know what is that to be specific, but maybe the transition from the dry season to rainy season. What are the things that you've done to know about what the climate change is? Do you care? I'm not really that care, but I care enough. But if from summer to rainy season, now it's summer, we should prefer to bring umbrella always in our back. Just that I don't really know the whole thing. Okay, thank you. What do you know about climate change? Honestly, we didn't really follow the news about climate change, the information. Do you care about the climate change or do you try to know about what is climate change? Uh, maybe if there's an information about the climate, we also want to know. Just that? Okay, thank you. Hi Ayu, what do you know about the climate change? The climate change in Indonesia now is unclear, like global warming maybe? It's like this month to that month is supposed to be rainy season, but what happened is dry season and vice versa. What have you done to prevent the climate change? Preserve the environment maybe? Thank you. You're welcome. Hello sir, what do you know about climate change? Hello, how are you? Fine. Uh, climate change, as far as I know, the word says change of climate, you see? Yes. Due to global warming and changes in the way daily habits of people are being irresponsible. So it has caused extreme weathers all over the world, places where rarely snow starts snowing, places where it doesn't rain starts raining, so basically extreme weathers, abnormal weathers. Yes. So what have you done to prevent it, like small things you've done to prevent it? Well, one of the best ways what I have done is I try to conserve water, conserve paper, try to conserve electricity. Yes. Yes. See, I try not to use electricity and I only use it when necessary. I use around, like I say, you know, air conditioning, I switch it off, yeah, I use natural air, you know. I try little, little things, even water, save water also, because I feel that Little by little, if everybody does that, it can uh, make a difference, you know. I think uh, people will have a better life, yeah. you know, because it, it costs too much nowadays. Yeah. You know, because that's the major cause of financial economic problems. Okay, sir. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you also. Yay. The climate change is the change of status quo distribution of weather patterns over a period caused by bio, biotic process, certain human activities, and variation of, radi of solar radiation. There are five actions to help the world. Let's check it out. Saving energy. The first simple way that we can do to help our art by saving energy, such as turn off the light when they're not needed, turn off the air conditioner when there is no one in the room,
And don't forget to unplug your charger if you're not charging. Number two, save water. Water is the most important basic needs of human beings. Can you imagine the world without water? How can we live? So what we need to do is don't forget to turn off the faucet if you're washing your hands or even brushing your teeth. And don't forget to turn off the water if you're taking a bath. That's the most important thing and the least thing you could do to help the world saving water. Number three, skip the plastic bottle. Bottle and plastic are the things that quite difficult to destroy because they should be burned if we want to destroy it and also have the impact of smoke and pollution. Therefore, it could be effect to the global warming. So, there are several ways to help our earth. The first is pick the tumbler than plastic bottle. Let's compare with the both of them. Plastic bottle can be used only for short term and they are impossible to be refilled. But tumbler can be used for a long term and they can be refilled. The usage of plastic bottle could cause a massive amount of unused and unrecycled plastic bottle. In the end, it could also make a big negative impact to the environment. So, it's better for us to bring our own tumbler. Number 4. Less gas. Greenhouse gases is the one causes of global warming that contain many kinds of gases, such as carbon dioxide, methane, and fossil fuel. There are a lot of activities that we can do to prevent from negative effect greenhouse gases. For example, using public transportation or driving together with your friends. So we don't have to use our own transportation. If every individual use their private transportation, can you imagine how many gases that the cars release to the atmosphere? The pollution? The traffic? Number 5. Think first before you buy. Many items found around the home can be used for different purposes. Before you throw those items away, think about how they can be reused. For example, air conditioner and fan. Fan is more eco-friendly and need less energy rather than air conditioner, even though they are also eco-friendly air conditioners, but too much air conditioner will make people depend on it a lot. Let's start to buy what you really need, not what you really want, or even it's so damn cute. It's just a cute stuff for a moment, and choose products which are friendly to our environment. It must be can use for a long period of time, so think first before you buy and put it back the things you don't need to buy. Do you know what will happen if you don't? All of your stuff, if it is too many, it will become useless in your home because you just use it once or twice. Then, waste incineration smoke content of carbon dioxide, which is make air pollution and it is not good for our atmosphere. And also, bunch of rubbish will cause flood in the rainy season. On the other hand, it is what will happen if you reuse your product and your creativity will arise to change it into something new and as worth as the old. Aren't they cute? There are five simple actions to help the world. We can start from ourselves and influence the other.